51, sync with the moon. Mantra, I embrace my ebb and flow, my many phases and the cycles of life. The moon is a powerful celestial entity that reflects the flow of our cycles and the many phases we go through. Look up the current moon phase for guidance on which energy will serve you best at this time. Guidance for each moon phase. New moon. Carve out the time and space to get clear on your desires and set your intentions. Write down what you want to manifest to amplify your intentions and keep track. Waxing Crescent Moon. Focus on manifesting your intentions and keep visuals around for support. First Quarter Moon. Take actions to show your devotion to manifesting your intentions. Waxing Gibbous. Celebrate the beauty of the human experience and all that is moving in your desired direction. Full Moon. Take note of how your intentions have manifested. Reflect with gratitude and let go of what is no longer serving you. Put your crystals and sacred belongings outside under the moonlight for recharging and cleansing. Waning Gibbous. Clean house and continue releasing what is no longer serving you. Third Quarter Moon. Connect with the natural world and let your awareness be drawn to the divine beauty of life cycles and timelines. Waning Crescent Moon. Cleanse the energy and reflect with gratitude on the cycle that's coming to a close. Throughout this moon cycle, track how you are feeling. Notice how your energy waxes and wanes and how your sexual appetite fluctuates. Also, if you are a female in your bleeding years, track the moon phase that's present when your menstrual cycles begin and end. This is a beautiful exercise to do over the long term so that you can see more trends and how your cycles relate to those of the moon. Be sure to keep an eye out for a local moon gathering that you can join, or if there isn't one in your area, host your own. Journal prompt. After spending a month tracking your energetic, sexual, and other cycles throughout the moon phases, what has been illuminated for you?